Welcome to another edition of Inside Swoop. I'm Cassie Goldman here to bring you up to date on what's going on this week. A number of small businesses have taken a hit due to the stay at home order, but you would think that a business revolving around working outside would have no problem. Larry Weaver says that with approximately 250 clients, there are still issues with working outdoors due to the size of their vehicles. The main thing that we have seen is that we cannot get into places to eat our lunch and we have to find places that I can run into real quick. Most of the sandwich shops, other fast food places that we normally were accustomed to going to, we're not able to get into them. Weaver's Landscaping is also seeing longer days and harder work with clients being home. These customers are normally at a maybe a, a building or a complex where they have $200,000, $300,000 landscaping budgets and now they want their homes to be like that. Thankfully, even with the challenges at hand, Larry Weaver does not predict any long-term effects due to coronavirus. Lots of families are getting new pets with more time at home, but not many are considering farm animals. Reese Weaver and her family got a set of chickens just before the stay-at-home order and have enjoyed watching them hatch and grow over the past six weeks. You see them, you know, the first week and then you see how much they grow, like every single day, it's crazy. They can be time consuming since they need to be cleaned often. Chickens are very messy. <laughs> so just having them like clean out their food and clean out their water, they get very disgusting. They are cute and entertaining now and the hard work will pay off when the fresh eggs arrive. Well, that's another edition of Inside Swoop. I'm Casty Goldman. Thanks for joining me on Inside Swoop.